Hey everyone, you're watching Wisdom Shots. Last month, Will Smith, my favorite Hollywood actor, released his memoir. The name of the book is Will. Instead of reading, I decided to listen to the audio version of the book on Audible, fully narrated by Will Smith. I must say this is one of the best audio books I've ever heard. His narration, intonation with background music and songs, rap songs, it was incredible. The book is raw. He opens up everything about his life. An epic tale of inner transformation and outer triumph. So let me share with you one of my favorite life lessons from this book. When he was 11 years old, Will Smith's father decided to construct a new wall in front of their shop. A big wall, roughly 12 feet high and 20 feet long. So rather than hiring a contractor or a construction company, his father thought it would be a good project for Will Smith and his younger brother Harry. So every day brothers would go to their father's shop after school to work on the wall. So they did everything all by themselves. They worked on weekends, holidays, vacation, without a break, non-stop. After some days, they were like completely discouraged. It was like a never-ending project. Will Smith says, I was certain that I would grow old and die still mixing concrete and carrying those buckets. But their daddy never let them stop. It didn't matter whether it was raining, whether it was hot, if they were sad or sick, it didn't matter. It didn't matter if they had a test in school the next day, absolutely no excuses. So brothers tried to complain and protest, but it made no difference. Seasons changed, friends came and when teachers retired, but the wall work was on. So one day the brothers were talking, you know, like, why do we have to construct this wall? This is impossible, you know, this will never get done. So daddy overheard this conversation. So he snatched a brick out of Will Smith's hand and held it in front of them. Stop thinking of the damn wall, he said. There is no wall, there are only bricks. Your job is to lay this brick perfectly and then move on to the next brick. Then lay that brick perfectly and then the next one. Don't be worried about the wall. Your only concern is one brick, one brick at a time. So brothers looked at each other and you know, they went back to mixing concrete. So when Will and his brother completed the wall 18 months later, one and a half years, their father told them, don't you ever tell me that you can't do something and walked into the shop. So Will Smith's father planned this intentionally to teach them a lesson. So Will Smith got his never say die attitude in his life from this kind of childhood experiences. So he credits his father for his superhuman work ethic. So just listen to this old video clip where he shared this experience. You, you don't try to build a wall. You don't set out to build a wall. You don't say, I'm gonna big, build the biggest, baddest, greatest wall that's ever been built. You don't start there. You say, I'm gonna lay this brick yeah. as perfectly as a brick can be laid. There will not be one brick on the face of the earth that's gonna be laid better than this brick that I'm gonna lay in this next 10 minutes. Yeah. And you do that every single day. And soon you have a and wall. And soon you have a wall. wall. Yeah. And I think psychologically, the advantage that that, that gives me over, over a lot of people that I I'm, have been in competition with in different situations is it's difficult to take the first step when you look how big yeah, exactly. the, the task is. The task is never huge to me. It's always yeah, me one too. brick. Me too. It's difficult to take the first step when we look at a big task, a big project. The task is never huge if you take one brick at a time, one step at a time. You do your best and take the next step, next, next brick. As they say, a journey of thousand miles begins with a single step. So in life and work, we all have a wall to construct, right? Your dreams, aspirations, big walls, wall of success, wall of dreams. So instead of dreaming of the wall all the time or instead of thinking it's an impossible wall, we have to take consistent action every day and give your best shot. The secret is one brick at a time, one task at a time, one step at a time. So over a period of time, if you're consistent and committed, you will have a big wall. So too often we convince ourselves that massive success requires massive action. Success is few simple disciplines you know, practiced every day. Now somewhere in the book, uh, he says, you know, dreams are built by discipline. And Will Smith is a classic case of this principle. 
so throughout the book you will learn that his discipline determination dedication devotion to work gave him all the success he has now he shares like how he prepared himself for more than one year to act as mohammed ali in the movie ali insane amount of hard work so will smith's dream wall was this i want to be the biggest movie star in the world so in his book will goes into great detail about how his friend and manager james set that dream into existence by reverse engineering the process he had a clarity of mission based on his big dream he set out to do everything following the model of successful actors before him he did things out of his comfort zone consistently like the way he constructed a big wall when he was 11 years old and he became the biggest movie star in the world so anything is possible if you are committed and if you believe in yourself this reminds me of my favorite scene from the movie pursuit of happiness on determination and achieving success don't ever let somebody tell you you can't do something not even me all right all right you got a dream you got to protect it people can't do something themselves they want to tell you you can't do it you want something go get it period 